Welcome back guys, we're here for some more dreams. I just finished recording the elevator and boy oh boy that was something. Uh, but I've been looking at this one, The Nightmare in Hollow Falls. Full game. This is by RH Rock 91 and I guess it's kind of Silent Hill expired. <clears throat> so out of the blue, Thomas Estrange Childhood Pal uh, corresponds by mail, requesting to reunite in the hometown of Hollow Falls, heading there. A sense of isolation fills the air, uh, as if half-dreaming, eerie occurrences in a town await. Twitter. <laughs> RH Gaming 19. Okay. So, we'll go ahead with this, see what it's about. Part 1. Oh, we got two parts. Part 1 and 2. Okay. Fixed camera mode or first person? I think first person will give a more uh, intimate experience. I like the music though. Piano. Soothing. It fixes the soul. Welcome to Hollow Falls. So I'm in the woods of Hollow Falls. It says welcome to Hollow Falls. Kind of grainy. Don't go in. Lock, maybe I can cut the lock with an axe. Found a wrench. Where's an axe? Need an axe. Here, someone chopped it up. I just need to find the axe. Probably back there. Here we go. Probably get rid of the latches with a wrench. Oh my god, should have said something. Can I run? Cannot run. Pick up wrench. Someone, is this like the actual entrance to the town? Someone locked it up. They didn't want anybody coming in this town. Right. I'm liking this, so like, this is pretty cool. Music's kind of nice, but eerie, too. Is this town abandoned? People actually live here? It's a hotel. Music box, but the ballerina is missing, and so is the handle. And a back alley. I'm just going to press X on everything. Dumpster, nothing of interest here. And I played a few Silent Hill light games on here. I just... Sorry if it's a little bit too much, but I just love everything to do with Silent Hill. Now the note reads, it's in the box I'll for you. Play the tune once and it'll open. But yeah, with rumors of... Uh, Silent Hill game possibly being revealed at the Game Awards. Um, sort of hype, but not. 
because there has been a bunch of rumors before, and those have come to nothing. It's locked. So hotel, is it open? Hold up, anything else back here? I don't need to go further, okay. Chris, while I'm away, I put my key for my house across the street in the lockbox under the counter. And you could go there if you're looking for help. The code for the lockbox combination is on a computer's desktop. Yo, what is that? Magazine. Put a table with some suitcases. Door's locked. Same magazine. Plenty of books for hotel guests. This is an elevator, which I assume doesn't work. It does work. Um, I didn't want to go anywhere yet. We'll stick to the ground floor first. Six key. Access I don't, denied. Don't have the password. All right, let's go upstairs. Oh, we're blocked. To the elevator then. All right, I'm sure this ride won't take as long as the last elevator ride. I think I need the crank for the uh, music box. It's hard to know what you can interact with and what you can't. Room number six. popular. <laughs> Woman shoes, teddy bear. Chris, thanks for taking this shift. Uh, we have one booking tonight in room three. Don't forget the password for the computer is 300, I'm oh, sorry, 32, uh, 302001. 302001. I think it's quite clean. At least I stock toilet paper. I remember the times when there was short supply in my city. Looks comfy. Alright, let's go. Sounds like every time I load it, is someone just going like, psst, psst, it's like, come here. Something about room three also, that, that note left. Don't have a key for this room, okay. Okay. 
God. I'm guessing room three. But I have no way inside. Access granted. I don't even need to put it in, okay. Access granted. Under the reception desk. This one? I think this may be the. Uh, across the street, okay. the house. Hold up. Okay, I need the handle too. Can't just put the uh, ballerina inside there. Alright, into this creepy ass house. Yo, this place is run down. Holy crap. Little clown doll. Living room. I won't turn on. So let's say Snowy instead of Sony. <laughs> What are we looking for? A filthy bed. Who would be sleeping in here? Homeless people, I would assume. It's too dark to see perhaps the light switch around if this place had electricity. Okay, got a switch. Got the music box handle. A shopping trolley. Okay, a lot of handprints. How's that? A goat? Um, okay. Bye now. No, 
God, I'm just crazy. Well, now I just stay where you stand. Yeah, I just stay where you stand. <laughs> Bye. Oh, I gotta find a key. You got a key for me, dude? We're gonna find a key. That should have happened already. Oh shit. Jesus Christ, dude. God damn it. <laughs> this open now. Alright, nothing please happen. Just let me out, let me out, let me out. Thank you. <laughs> uh, it's night time now. I'm liking the street. It's, it's everything about it. Like, the environment, the textures and all that. The little details. Something's not right here. Stay away. If you need to get in, I'm waiting with the keys by the welcome sign at the town's entrance near the woods and log piles. Okay. Strange. Better go back all the way then. to even wait here any longer. I phone the police. If you need it, here's a hotel key. Just don't go into room 3. I heard the most unsettling noise. Something is deeply wrong and dangerous in there. Chris. Wait. Are we Chris or this person speaking to us, Chris? I'm, not, I'm confused. <laughs> Whatever. We're going. Hold on. Uh, okay, never mind. We're going back to the hotel. Room 3. Someone was follow following me. Okay. 
back in. Gotta go to room three. The scream came from there. The person said they heard an uh, unsettling noise. They didn't say scream, so something else is going on in there. Here we are. What's gonna go? What's gonna happen? Don't be creepy. It's the regular old room. It looks comfy. Turn off the main line switch. Check the washrooms halfway open. Why do I have to switch it off? What is this BS? Nah, fam, nah, no. Oh boy, here we go. Christ, dude. God damn it, I knew something was going to be there. <laughs> okay, what now? It's a lot of goo or blood. Oh, are we going into the uh, nightmare world? If there is a nightmare world in here. What the hell is that? Everything has changed. I'm, am I in the same building? I don't think so, dude. We're in the nightmare world. There's sort of siren. And a part one. I'm gonna do part two. Part the or dulce for those who speak Spanish. Here we go. Nightmare world. This is awesome. As I mentioned before, I love Silent Hill inspired stuff because the new Silent Hill stuff, eh. Honestly, I actually did like Homecoming and Downpour. <laughs> I didn't play that other one though, that it was on the PSP or Vita, Book of Memories. Never played that one. I'm trying to think of other good horror games that are like Silent Hill-esque. Evil Within? Kind of like it. I mean, it's kind of like Silent Hill, sort of. It's just a weird world you're in and everything. I like two more than one. Evil Within, I mean. Alright, so... What are we doing in this world? Am I just looking around for stuff? There's a note over there. Elevator jam. I have to wedge. I have wedged it open. Uh, oh, somehow there's a note here. I heard those things at the end of the hallway. They took mummy away.
There was a noise behind me. I should check it. Really? Dude? Pick up room 2 key. Electricity in here? I don't think so. Give me that crowbar. Stuff is gonna get whacked. Agatha, Agatha's diary. There's a latch with a small lock. I'll need a key. So, what can I use a crowbar for? This would have looked in third person. Yo, this elevator. Ground floor, please. Heard something. Oh, that's ominous. Teddy bear with his head removed. There's a hair pin attached to its hair. Didn't read that last part. Does that teddy bear have hair? I could do you have to go back up, right? <laughs> totally forgot what they said I could use the hairpin for, but I'll figure it out. Oh, the uh, the book in room two, the diary. That is right, that is right. Does stuff just change again? What's this? A mechanical wooden door with a numerical code lock to unlock. It looks important, I should try to get in there. Try it later. Gotta go to room two. It's always blocked now. Back there. Hello. I'll leave you be. Whoa. Okay. It's changed again. What was all this stuff? Flowers?
Oh my god, I'm stuck. God damn it. Oh man, I'm stuck. Okay. Hold on. Hopefully this works. Alright, we're good. No reason to place anything down here at the moment. Okay. So this isn't room two. One in the wrong room. Page reads, there's a formula here to get through that door. Only light can reveal the blackened parts. Okay, I get it. Five six zero one seven. Oh, okay. I thought that was a five. Six 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 zero one seven seven seven. Six 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 zero one seven seven seven. Okay. through it. Here we go. Where are we going? Oh, I didn't even notice. Okay. Long hallway, always great. One open. Well, oh boy, that's good. 
Uh, Granny knows these people aren't real. It took me some time to see what she meant. She never told me about the letters, though. They weren't real. How come they write to me? How come they locked me up in here? She told me they can't change anything in the real world, but they do. Sometimes I hear Granny wake up during the night to see them coming up to her room. She is furious. Oh boy. Don't like that. Hold on, guys. Alright. This door opened up here. Someone else's house. Okay. Definitely here earlier. There's ashtrays and newspapers around this couch. I wouldn't want to sleep in this room. That face is staring right in there. Agatha, don't stay up past your bedtime. I don't know how late your mom uh, lets you stay up, but when you're in my house, I expect you to do as I say. You don't want to wake me up in the middle of the night. I should probably turn everything off in this house so I don't wake anyone. What am I supposed to get? Oh, turning everything off, okay. Sucks. <sighs> oh, God.
I think that's everything. What's left to be turned off? Hold up. Here. I can't stand it with that here. I can't sleep those creatures around in Granny. She's one of those things too. To see what's in the jar next to her front door. Can you please take my place tonight? Go to my room before you wake her. Here's my key. Alright. Are off. Let's head upstairs. What are you doing up this late? What are you doing up this late? What are you doing up this late? What's ringing? Back to the first floor hotel. The door can be open now. Don't let her catch you. She can't see me like this. It'll make it worse. Alright. Gotta go back. dog went running off with our set of keys today. I appreciate your return to the maze AP as we only have one set in our family, Karen. Alright. Wish I had a flashlight. It's very dark. The dog's hunting him not near him like this, so there's a hole in the fence behind him. Perhaps I blew him out there. Okay. Oh. 
Okay. Time to get the key from the doghouse. And I guess we're supposed to use the key. I can't see where to go, jeez. Grab a weapon, please. A uh, poem, grounding the seasons dry so I grow deep. Bears but a hope, but the only one bear. I now contort and shift the other pole to the other pole to another age. One day the worlds unite, foreign bodies, a stranger's land. One day tainted water will reveal nature's palette. What it means, but deep. Flamingos. Oh, someone went digging. All right, let's go down in the hole for some reason. Very comforting music for being stuck in a hole trying to find a way out. Not hating though. I'm liking it. Where are we going now? Oh, hello. You finally come. I've waited here years. My innocence hijacked by those demons. I needed someone uncorrupted by those forces. But also for you to now see the decay of the world I've lived. Thomas, you were that person to save me. My only hope down here. My mother and grandmother may be lost to the things of Hollow Falls. But for all this time, I refused to let it happen to me. You took my place in experiencing the horror for me. It's time I took it back amongst the living and leave you here. Where are you? Oh, what? She takes Thomas's place, and so Thomas is just stuck there. Right, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that. That was uh, Nightmare on Hollow Falls, the full game by RH Rock 91. Uh, I enjoyed that, that was pretty good. Now, very Silent Hill esque, and also you could play in third person, which I don't know how that would go since there's like a scare that that is for first person, but uh, yeah, I enjoyed that nice little story too. And the music was pretty good, very soothing music for this horror game, <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's it. See you guys in the next video.